from the Star Brigade series of G.I. Joe figures, it's the Cobra Bat, Battle Armored Android Trooper. Check this guy out. Not exactly the same figure as the original Bat from way back in the day. This is the Star Brigade series from the early 1990s. Love the packaging. That is loud and obnoxious. We can check out the back here. There's a number of other Star Brigade soldiers. And you can even get a Star Brigade armor bot, which looks like one of these Entrati Battle Pods from Robotech. Don't forget to clip and save this for your G.I. Joe Command files. It's the Cobra Bat Information Sheet. Take a bulldozer, strap a few missile launchers and assault rifles to it, and you've got yourself a bat. You've got yourself a party is what you've got. We could keep him in the packaging, but where's the fun in that? Besides, I want to see if the Cybertech launcher really shoots. Included with the bat is a collector's card featuring Cobra Commander, the world's least competent evil leader. And there's this thing. Attention, recruits, G.I. Joe wants to hang out with you. Well, I want to hang out with Cobra. They were always way cooler than G.I. Joe. Here's the bat. Looks very different than the old one, which I used to, used to have. I don't know where he went anymore, but I'm sure I'll get another one one of these days. He's roughly the same size as one of the old school G.I. Joe figures or new releases from Hasbro. Here he is standing next to a Strato Viper. He comes with a bunch of guns, but you have to actually use manual labor to remove them from their, uh, their packaging containment thing here. It's not that hard. Is that a flamethrower? It may as well be. Why not? Ready to shoot some Joes. Note that his elbows bend and he comes with a knife. So he's ready to stab some Joes after he shoots them. The bats don't mess around. And you can make his little legs look like he's running. The bat is a backstabber. Who knew? Here's a close-up look at the detailing on his armor and helmet. His arms move. He feels substantial. You can't twist him from side to side, but his legs do bend. He's got giant feet. And he's a pretty cool figure. Note this part right here. What we're going to do is take the rocket launcher and attach that to his arm. Then what you do is take one of these missiles and insert that into the rocket launcher until it clicks. There's a little button back here. Another Joe bites the dust. My bad, that was a My Little Pony. To demonstrate the power of the Cybertech launcher, we are going to stage a live execution. The Jungle Viper captured a G.I. Joe wandering around the fortress, and the bat is going to now do away with him. The Cobra Bat was donated to the show by Bob in South Euclid, Ohio. Thank you, Bob. Here's another one just for you. He never misses because he's an android. But wait, we're on the same team!